there's so many different styles of Chardonnay, really. I mean, they go from the, you know, big, fat, very heavy, broad Chardonnays in the days of old to the extremely lean, very fine, tight, mineral Chardonnays. Now, Margaret River Chardonnay sits somewhere in the middle. We have the power, the fruit and the weight that comes into the wine, but we also have those layers of complexity and that tightness and minerality that finesses the wine considerably. What we've learned is embracing the environment by not clarifying the Chardonnay when it goes to barrel, using only the natural yeast from the vineyards that give us this wild and wonderful characteristic. Our environment is so clean that we end up having a beautiful yeast health culture in the vineyard. So we just allow the natural yeast to perform and they have their own personality and character. And every little section of Chardonnay has its own personality and character of yeast population. So we get all these unique parcels, wonderful character that comes from the vineyard. So we're taking a bit more of a risk in allowing that really high solids juice to ferment out naturally. Your wine is exposed to any number of other uh, microbial processes while it's fermenting but we see all of those as just adding character and just being really true to the juice and not sort of trying to come in and uh, manipulate it too much, just letting the juice speak for itself, each parcel completely separate to every other, so that uh, at no point during the wine's life, through ferment or during the ageing process in barrel, will we cross-blend any of our parcels. And then it's only after eight, nine months that we look at all those Chardonnays as potential blending components to put together. So we're really trying to bring people away from just focusing on that, that powerful Chardonnay nose and into some of the delicacy and finesse, texture, some of those really interesting mouthfeel characters that you get from full solids, wild fermentation in good oak, all coming together and producing a balanced, lengthy, textural, interesting experience to uh, show people what we think absolutely pristine Margaret River Chardonnay should look like unadulterated uh, in, its, in its most natural and elegant form. Every region has its own style and I think the style of Margaret River has wonderful prominence, wonderful character and personality that I think is, is so attractive to so many people. It's interesting yet it's fine.